Well, here we go. The debut performance in the EASHL. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. The icebreakers start with possession as we are now underway. You got it, you got Slides it. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Makes the save. Right, right, and angles it over to Burton. And that's just out of reach. Right. Looks to get the puck over to Gordon. Looking to make something happen along the boards. How did he stop that one? Denies him again. The Nighthawks have it against the wall. From the defensive side, they move the puck around. That's just a great heads up read at center ice. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Works it across to Burton. Fires it. Makes the save by barely with that one. Penalty coming up here. The Nighthawks are being called for tripping. Vince can create turnovers with his truculent zone ability, guys. He uses big hits to pressure his opponents. Barnett's a steady defender who's known to join the rush. Let's see if one of these stars can give their team the upper hand in this matchup. Back to you now. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Oh, and it just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Repetitive practice has made him an expert at this shot, James. He is so dangerous. He can get it off quick and he can get it off in stride. He does just that, but the cold tender makes an incredible oh, save. Oh, oh. Taken down, and the officials caught it. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Diaby's actions pretty evident in the eyes of the officials here for tripping. Batten down the hatches. Things should open up here with a little four-on-four on, four on the ice. Four on four can be pretty confusing when it comes to coverage. You know that your defense have the forwards, but the forwards have to be able to contain the D as well. So it's complete defense out there. But Nighthawks penalty has expired. They now go to work on the power play. Made the stop on that play. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. Bears hoping for some puck luck here on this face off as they continue to play shorthanded. And they win the offensive zone face-off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Tyler's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. The icebreakers will go to work here in the offensive zone. Keep your head up. Oh, it's in the air. We got a penalty coming up. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. Wessel Blow stopping the play. Well, you can see in his body language that he's frustrated with himself as he dances to the penalty box for the second time this period. Gordon's got that quick release when he shoots while in motion, guys. That's his make it snappy zone ability, and he can fire goalies before they can even catch up to the shot. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Ten seconds! With possession along the wall. The icebreakers will have a chance to go to work here on the man advantage after the penalty expired. Bitz has it in the defensive end. Slides it on over to Diaby. Now a quick pass to Buttersworth. The Nighthawks gain possession of the defensive zone. Quick shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Butters were stick handling in his own zone. Bears plays it against the boards. From behind the net. The icebreakers squander a golden opportunity to take 
take the lead here. And he was right there to make the stop on that play. Oh, that power play really wasn't effective at all, James. And Coach won't be happy. A lot of possession time, but it correlated to nothing. You have to create some motion and be quick to be able to open up seams and lanes to the net. The icebreakers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Musa quickly over to Gordon. Oh, my God! Yeah. Scores! James, how surprised do you think the goaltender is? He just spins around and tries to clear the puck and he fires it past the tender. The icebreakers are up by one here in the back half of this opening frame. Yeah, and they deserve the lead there. There's no question about it, James. I mean, they've been the better team. They've been first to the puck, and they've owned the majority of shots to net. Not afraid to yeah, put yeah. it there. Now they got to continue this pace and see if they can get ahead by more than one. Carries the puck up through center. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Moves it around along the half wall. And he loses control here. Back, 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 the icebreakers gain possession along the wall. Diaby's got the puck. Centering feed. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Oh, just a great heads up play by Burton. Now over to Bruner. The Nighthawks move the puck in the defensive zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. The Icebreakers have done a great job moving their feet tonight, and they lead here midway through the first. The Nighthawks win the draw here in their own end. The Icebreakers ready to go on the attack. And that slides right out to center ice. And it's a quick pass to Buttersworth. And he slides it quickly to Bears. From the point, looks to make something happen. With the stop. Well, a nice save by the goaltender, and even better is that he redirects the puck to the corner to safety. Great extension on his part to poke it away. Moves it over to Buttersworth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, textbook poke check to turn that over. Shot! And that's punched away with the blocker. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Well, everyone has a job and a role to do, and guess what? It's about PK execution right now. They have the one goal lead, now they're protecting it. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. Well, a timely power play at this juncture of the game, James, to even it up. This is huge for this power play. Your big stars, they need to shine. Oh, aggressive move as he pokes it away. They move the puck out of harm's way. Handle it. Go. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. First period nearly in the books here. Takes the feed from his own end. That's how you get north in a hurry. Fantastic stretch pass. The icebreakers get a hold of the puck under man. Gets it out of his own end. Looking to break out here on the power play. We got a whistle offside the call. Still some precious time left on this power play as they get set to drop the puck. The icebreakers win possession here in the open ice. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Fitz penalty is about to expire. The Icebreakers preserve the lead as their penalty killers get the job done. Period number one in the books. First intermission entertainment is on deck here. You can also have time to go grab a drink, grab a hot dog, and we'll be back with period number two in moments.
first 20 is in the books. Let's see what this second period offers. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. All right, Pounder, how would you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? The Icebreakers are putting on a shooting clinic out there right now. Real entertaining game to watch. And Coach will be real happy about being off. They came, they saw, they took advantage of the rebound and scored. a tougher play than it looks, James. You have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. The Icebreakers have extended the lead to two goals here in the second, and at this rate, Cheryl, I don't think they're stopping. Well, no, because, I mean, they've been good in all three zones, haven't they? I mean, you're watching their goaltender just put on a clinic, and then their offense gets to work. They're dominating in terms of shots, and they're finding a way to put it in the back of the net. Hard to get the puck off their stick. The Nighthawks gain possession. Come on, come on. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Icebreakers have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And he makes that save as well. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. Shot, he works to get in tight, and when he gets an opportunity in that area, he simply doesn't miss. How many times have we seen him score from here, James? In tight to the net. He doesn't need much time. All he has to have is hands ready, and he'll bury it. But Nighthawks needed that, Cheryl, and they seem to have some life now. Well, they've shortened the deficit, and there's nothing better to get you back in the game than one goal to put themselves on their toes. But again, they're going to have to have an attack mentality if they want to get an equalizer. Puts it in deep. Oh, Passes oh, on over to Tyler. Butters first the puck. Oh, Grabs it in his own end. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. The Icebreakers have it now. Wagner's last save was oh, in on oh, oh, He scores! Oh, wow, what a finish! Well, I love that he used his speed and didn't slow down, James. And it's all about patience and composure, outweighting the goaltender, finding the room and burying it. Man, he's just effortless when he gets that shot off, isn't he? I mean, he's moving his feet, and he just pulls that puck in towards his body, and a quick snap of the wrist, it's in the back of the cage. Quick feed to Diaby. Right up the cut into the attacking zone. Nope. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Slick feed. Rock. Takes the pass. And that goes off target. He typically connects with the snapshot, James. He's got those quick wrists. And I just believe when he pulled that into his body, he just overrotated a little too much as he tried to change the angle of his shot. He missed. Oh, and he whiffs. Loses his balance on the play. But Nighthawk's going to work on offense. Pumps it away in his own end. And they'll go on the attack. Great pressure by Burton. And a great read to turn that play aside. The Icebreakers have a decided edge in the shot department and also in the score as well here in the second. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Bears moves the puck. Moves it to the middle. Couldn't complete the pass. The Icebreakers gain control of the puck against the wall. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. Here's a shot, and that goes off a player in front. The Icebreakers gain control of the puck. Diaby's into the up. Break away.
business-like approach as he's on the road. He just says, yeah, just bring it. I mean, gets a hattie to boot. Well, this is just a fantastic shot that the goaltender can't get a read on because he's moving his feet, and therefore the goalie cannot get set to it, and that disguised point of delivery, man, is it beautiful, and he puts it in the back of the cage. The icebreakers continue to show no signs of slowing down here tonight. Well, they keep filling the net, James. They fill it because they've got the puck on their stick. I mean, they've led ozone possession time here, but they're doing something with it, not just hanging out on the perimeter. Read it perfectly and breaks up the play. The Nighthawks need to find an answer in this game. They're halfway through it. They haven't dictated pace. They've been back on their heels. If they want to get back in it, they're going to have to find some energy and some momentum. The Icebreakers lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. Bears has it in their own end. Right. Slides the puck across to Gordon. Here's a chance. And he turned that one aside. I'm surprised he didn't score here. I mean, he's got such a magical shot. It is so quick, and he disguises the release. But the goaltender caught up to it. What a chance there! Well, it almost looked like he converted a quick release shot. He had no time or space, but unable to put it by. Off his stick! Oh, that had some heat on it. He makes the save. Run. Grabs the puck. And look at this. They've turned this offensive end into a pressure cooker. Here they come on the attack. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. The Icebreakers are on cruise control here in the second. They have absolutely dominated. Bears wins the draw. They'll go to work here in the offensive zone. Here's a shot. Sacrifices the body to block it. You got time? Steps across the blue line. Good defensive ah, stop ah. with the poke check. And they Go. turn it over in the neutral zone. Push. Along the half wall with the puck. Right. And the play right. continues. Yeah. Under a minute to go here inside the second period. Right. The Nighthawks look to break out before the game right. ends. Referee singles penalty coming up here with a delayed call. There's the whistle, and here's the call. The icebreakers are off to the box. Interference the call. here on this broadcast, so don't even think about going anywhere. We're back with more in a moment. Welcome back, James Sabalski, ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. The Icebreakers penalty killers get off to a good start, winning possession here. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. The Nighthawks take possession in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Brewer. And they continue to apply pressure here. Breaks up the play with a poke check. 
Wagner said a quiet night, James. He's been watching most of the game from the other end because of the offensive nature of his team tonight. But man, does he make a nice save there. And that's showing that he's emotionally engaged. He's staying prepared even though he hasn't been busy. Cuttersworth almost back on the ice. The Hawks scoop it up along the boards. The man advantage is over. The power play unit looks stifled out right. there, and they have to make adjustments and read off what the PK unit is doing, and there was none of that. Quick pass to Barnett. And he slides it quickly to Tyler. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Gordon's taking it from his own end. And here at center, that's intercepted. Puck scooped up by Martinez. Here they come on the attack. Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind and he's going to be the foundation tonight. From center, they get into the attacking area. Moves it. Oh, what a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. Diaby's got the puck now at his own end. Can't hang on after that hit. The icebreakers have it now. Good solid check, and he loses control of it. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Moves it quickly over to Tyler. Makes the save on the snubber. Oh, what a hit. He got all of that hip check. Martinez is certainly showing his competitive flair out there. Something is bothering him. There's no question about him, but he's going to finish the shift. Barnett's hauled down. Penalty on the way. Well, the official is right there to make the call, and no question about it, it's tripping. Anytime you take someone's feet out from under them, you're going to hit the box for two. Power play unit going back to work. They haven't scored yet in the game on the power play, but no need to get frustrated. They all bring a different skill set. It's the reason why they're out there. The icebreakers will play it from the defensive zone. Slides it across the corner. Quick feed to Barnett. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. What a goal! All effort. Now well, we've seen it so many times before. He has such a knack to lose coverage in front of the net and inside. And when he gets a puck on his stick, he ain't missing from there. Ah oh, man, James, he is just lethal when he is in the paint. He knows how to shield and maneuver his body to be able to get pucks off quickly. It's what he does best, and he buries one there. The Nighthawks don't have time on their side, but they're starting to scratch back. They're scratching back, they're clawing back, but they're going to have to take some offensive chances. D are going to have to start jumping in, opening up lanes, and creating odd man rushes. They go on the attack through center. Shot, and he puts that one aside with ease. Goaltender covers up, we got a stoppage in play. Carla Payne is standing by with who she thought had the better performance. Barnett's has been fun to watch here in this one, guys. Even though both players have contributed offensively, I just like how he's played the game in this one. Denies him! He got all of it! Go, go, go! Here's a short pass to Diaby. What a steal in his own end! Barnett's moving the puck through his own zone. And he takes the feed. Here's a chance, sends it in front! Got time! And he takes the dish. Shot. Poked away in the offensive end. Oh, 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 Spectacular oh, stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot, and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it. You've got to be fast, you've got to be quick and show those reflexes. He does that and makes the save. Pushes it across to Gordon. We got a stoppage, let's get the call. The Nighthawks are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call. They'll go back to work on their special teams. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Puck right. picked up by the open oh, ice. Yeah. On the attack it along is. the boards. Locks them. And play continues as that goes off the glove. The Nighthawks have possession shorthanded. 
Tyler's going to play it against Ooh. the half wall. The Nighthawks have it from the corner. <laughs> Takes the puck. Jeez. Tyler is able to corral that pass. He's got the puck on his stick. You know he's dangerous. He's got two in the game, and he's looking for another. Bears plays the puck. Makes it look easy. Great positioning with the pad save. And they clear that puck. From the left side, they gain the zone. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. As he makes his way to the penalty box yet again, James, you can see that he's on a first-name basis with the officials in this one. Another sense of urgency for this man advantage unit as they go back to work. Especially teams in particular power plays, they can create so much momentum, but when you don't execute, it can really go the other way in favor of your opponent. It's really disrupted the flow of the game. They've got to get back on track. And there's the save. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Power play set to roll on as the setters get ready for the faceoff. Bears has got possession. Let's see what they can do with it now. The Nighthawks take it along the wing. Shot! And that goes off someone in front that doesn't reach the net. A chance for the rush here. Digging in defensively to stop that rush. Tries to get it out of their own end. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. Keats ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. And they take possession off the draw here at their own end. Time running out with this man advantage. Here we go. From the neutral zone now. Knocked away with the stick by Keats. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty handed on that one. You can have all the ozone possession time on a power play in the world and you don't convert. Why? Because that's where you have it, on the outside. You have to find ways to create seams, diagonal lines to the net, to be able to shoot off the pass and get scoring opportunities. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. He's such a phenomenal shooter, James. I mean, when he shoots in stride, he is absolutely lethal when he pulls that puck in and disguises his shot. He can change the angle so quickly, get it off fast. Goaltender always has to be ready. Stop the cold! Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Icebreakers have some breathing room as they lead by a pair. It's 4-2. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. Slides into Bears. The Icebreakers carry it along the wall. Teed up and turned away on his part. The Icebreakers have it against the wall. Feeds the puck across to Bears. Offside the call. We'll get a faceoff coming up. The Icebreakers haven't stopped putting pucks on net, and they lead it here late in the third. Bears has won it here at center. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Go, go, go. Quick pass to Tyler. Pitts plays it now. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Couldn't catch up to that pass. And this one's in the books. Well, big moment here in the EASHL. First game. First victory. And you know, it's really important, James, that they take a moment to celebrate it and embrace it. I mean, wins go by too quickly, and when it's the first ever, you have to find a way to appreciate the moment. Joining us, we had a great time. Hope you did too. For all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski. Good night.